Hey everyone, this is Daryl from Daily Crypto Trading Signals coming to you live, live from Vietnam, guys. Great time to be live, and uh, this is my uh, evening drive time update. And uh, yeah, I'm feeling pretty pep. I'm feeling pretty happy right now. Things are looking pretty good for Dogecoin. Things are looking pretty good for crypto. Overall, the markets are up right now, and this is pretty much unusual after the halving. Normally, we'd expect uh, some some droppage out there, but we're not seeing any droppage. Also, uh, a lot of analysts are now talking about Dogecoin to one dollar again. It seems that it's happening, and also too, we're seeing that more inflows to the Bitcoin spot ETF are happening right in front of us right now. So that is also pretty good. And these are going to be some of the major catalysts that we're going to talk about. Also, some of the major catalysts that are going to send crypto higher and higher. And some people are saying that we could see a hundred thousand a dollar Bitcoin in a matter of weeks, guys, in a matter of freaking weeks. So I know a lot of your portfolios are looking pretty good right now. Remember, non this is financial advice. Go back and watch all the other videos. I would freaking appreciate it. It's a great time to be alive. And just disclaimer, disclaimer, I ain't driving. I ain't driving. My driver's driving. So just to, just to put that put that in perspective because some people like to uh, to go nuts out there uh, from from that perspective so got perspective, perspective. so we're seeing right now that uh, Bitcoin is up uh, two percent right now we're seeing most of the cryptocurrencies are up particularly old coins are also pumping away right now Solana wanna wanna is up we still need to get Solana back up to 200 bucks guys so that's a little bit of a debit honor out there but overall things are looking good uh, hopefully this will this will continue we're seeing the bonkster the bond Bonk bonk on the head is up is up over 42 percent so that is pretty good we're seeing uh the uh, flokester is up as well the pep pepper is up uh so we're seeing a lot of the meme coins are pumping like crazy right now even the whiffer the whiffer whiffer waffer is up right now uh so that is good we're seeing fear and greed right now is also up again as well uh other good news is as i said earlier one of the reasons we're seeing that bitcoin is pumping right now is that we can see the total inflow total inflow of uh, bitcoin to the etfs is uh, 650 million and in a, in, a, in a surprising move, in a surprising move by GBTC, they actually did buy the freaking dip. They bought the dippity dip and they actually uh, picked up uh, $143 million worth of Bitcoin. So that is pretty good. We take a look at that in terms of Bitcoin. That is pretty pretty freaking awesome out there, guys. So things are looking pretty good. Uh, we can see that uh, almost 4.82% of all the Bitcoin in existence right now is held by the uh, ETF so that is pretty good don't forget we got uh, uh, the official announcement still pending from when you can actually buy the ETFs Bitcoin ETFs uh, on the Hong Kong Stock Exchange they've already said that they're going to do it it's just a matter of when will retailers start happening I think it's probably going to happen on Monday I think Monday we should see that the Hong Kong Bitcoin Ethereum ETF should go live and you'll actually be able to buy that guy so overall the crypto markets are looking pretty good uh, Dogecoin uh, Bitcoin is down 3% on the on the the last 30 days oh it's what what, what happened what, what, weird you see that it's weird weird must be tacticals tacticals at coin market cap we're seeing ethereum is also up right now uh bnb is up uh solana is up seven percent we need a lot more we need a lot more from solana xrp is up doja roger is up and market cap is 23 billion 23.2 versus the turn coin now briefly briefly when uh those uh, did tank we did see that uh Tungcoin was in the ninth, in the eighth spot, so that's pretty good. We have a nice reversal. We're seeing that also Cardano is in the tenth spot, and I got a feeling that we could see the Shibby Wibby Wibby actually pass, actually pass uh, uh, Cardano. I mean, Cardano's really got me pissed off. Can I say that? Uh, it, it's just not performing as, as expected out there, guys. So we're seeing DXY is uh, just kind of accumulating sideways. We're seeing Bitcoin right now is uh, had a nice move today. Hold this whole area here. We've still got this support line. I think that we're... You know we're going to see a seventy-three thousand, seventy-four thousand dollar Bitcoin pretty soon. Our next level of resistance is around about sixty-nine thousand dollars out there, and we're going to talk about the white cup pattern. I think it's uh, we're, that is uh, in play, and we're seeing that we're going to see a nice breakout uh, to the upside. Ethereum is also looking good above my just above my trend line at three one six zero, so not too shabby out there, uh, guys. In case you didn't know, it looks like a new channel in the weekly Bitcoin chart has developed in the week of the Bitcoin halving, which is good. Which is good news and based on that we've got a low of 150k a high of 170k we are right here bitcoin having this week so you know we could see this kind of thing happening out there uh, if the sentiment keeps going on the same uh, on the same and bt moves within the channel we could see btc uh, very very soon and that could be a matter of weeks guys 
weeks, weeks, weeks. So not too shabby out there. Not too shabby. Uh, look at this Bitcoin having price index before and after the having. So you can see before the having, uh, after the having, uh, back in back in the, uh, 2012 at 54x, back in uh, 2016 uh, we had a 13x. Back in 2020 we had 7.4x. So right now we've just halved. Where are we going to go? Uh, you know we had a peak of 92x here. Uh, we had a peak here of a 30x. Then you know, then a 5x, then a 13x. Guys, where are we going to go with Bitcoin this time? I think we're going to see huge, huge pump because we've never had Bitcoin ETFs before. This is the first time. Uh, this coming in from Seth looks like uh, Bitcoin bull phase lasts 150 days, 150 weeks. Excuse me. Uh, smash the likes, guys. Uh, 75 weeks have passed since 16k uh, bottom. 75 weeks left until the top. Until the top of the top top, and I'm thinking that we could see a top 150, 200 thousand dollars out there. So, guys, keep this very simple. We've got 75 weeks till the top. So, once we hit the 75 week, might be a good time to sell. Not financial advice, guys. Uh, big announcements from the Fed. 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 We got PCI index on Friday out there. It uh, looks like also hedge fund veteran Mark uh, says that the FOMO is in that the FOMO will be coming. For Bitcoin and when that happens incoming as Bitcoin completes having here's when so we could see a huge huge amount of FOMO coming in and uh, speaking of Bitcoin investor day a hedge fund veteran says Bitcoin's latest having kicked Bitcoin's fair value from 50 to eighty thousand dollars guys so that is pretty good and instead of going from 50 where the fair value is pre having to 100k actually I think it will probably go to 80 eighty thousand where eighty thousand is once you get the start to FOMO guys so we could see a big pump coming in for Bitcoin guys and gals. It uh, looks like Wyckoff accumulation pattern is on track and we're right here right now uh, and this is calling for a huge huge like a huge huge pump uh, seventy two thousand dollars should be our fair value should be happening pretty soon guys absolutely going to happen out there. Uh, we got lots of Dogecoin news to cover, guys. Don't forget to go follow me on my Twitter. I appreciate uh, what's happening. Accumulation. We talked about this this morning. Uh, looks like the mean coin market cap is also up 11.68 percent right now. Uh, one of the biggest, uh, one of the biggest mean coins that jumped up right now has been. Uh, look at look at Shiba Inu, 19 percent. Whiff is up 12 percent. Pep is up 10.4 uh, percent. Floki is up 15 percent. Bonk is up 31%. Guys, this is huge. Look at Cat with Dogs is up as well. So a lot of these memes are just pumping. Look at this one. Uh, Dogen is up 51%. Looking pretty, pretty, pretty good out there. Uh, where's the Dogecoin price right now? So Dogecoin is at 16.16 out there. So that is pretty good. Uh, we're seeing that the Dogecoin overall right now is uh, still in this uh, daily uh, bull flag. And this calls for a huge breakout. And if this happens, this could take us pretty close to 45 cents out there, guys. So I still think a big parabolic move is going to happen to Doge. I think Doge going to $1 is more likely than ever before, guys. Smash the likes and show some love out there. So we're seeing that the total market cap for Dogecoin is up right now, almost 6.82% at 23.27 billion. So looking pretty, pretty nice out there, guys. And we're up 1.32%. Remember, it's Sunday in the US. So uh, Sunday here in a, in a Vietnam and Sunday morning in the US. So guys, if we can pump positive on the weekend, wait till the wait till the weekday happens when the Bitcoin ETFs are happening, guys. When, when will Doge hit $1? Well, I think Doge, Doge Day is a big catalyst. We haven't heard anything from Elon Musk. Uh, that will be a big catalyst. When will Doge hit one dollar Doge Day catalyst? It's going to happen soon, guys. I think that we could see probably around uh, around Halloweeny. We could see a Doge coin hit one dollar, guys. So, yeah, Doge coin. Uh, it's going to happen, guys. It's just a matter of time. Uh, happy Doge Day, everybody. And don't forget, if you've got your crypto on a centralized exchange, get it the freak off there and go down there. Follow my link. Don't forget to smash the likes and subscribe out there, guys. So looks like, uh, you know, Dogecoin is looking pretty good. If we can stay above the 100-day uh, EMA, then we are set to explode, guys. So Super Trend is about to happen. I, I am simply amazed that Dogecoin is up right now. 20 cents will quickly come once we blast past the 100-day EMA. And we're getting pretty close to doing that, guys. Remember that most of the Dogecoin holders are in the money right now. Most of them are in the money. Huge pump is coming. Absolutely a huge freaking 
pump is about to come guys and you can see who's in the money who's not in the money right now we're seeing that 83 percent of all those green holes are in the money not too shabby out there guys i've seen not too shabby out there uh we've seen that open interest for dogecoin is also added six percent so that is pretty good out there uh we're seeing that uh, dogecoin bottom is in parabolic move is coming soon one freaking dollar out there looks like shiba inu is also pumping right now it's at uh it's at 0269. I think we're going to hit 30, guys. I actually think that we got uh, 30 cents, th not 30 cents, but 30 coming in for Dogecoin. It's going to be happening sooner than later out there. So I think this is about the level we're going to hit. Uh, it's the next resistance level that uh, should be in and get past, guys. So that's about it for this video, guys. I would appreciate it. Go follow me on Twitter. Uh, be blessed. Be well. Uh, in case you're wondering what's going on, I'm on my drive time home, and it looks something like this. Let's take a look looks something like this so this is the my drive time update guys looking like this that's what i see every day coming home from work guys so yeah welcome to vietnam they still love the motorbikes here it's insane nobody follows the rules everybody drives like crazy you need to have uh, eyes in the back of your head so guys let's get ready for a huge 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 day uh much love out there i'll see you in the freaking next one peace out